Hello guys, uh, welcome back to the channel. So in this video, I'm going to show you guys the ultimate way for you to get, uh, I mean, to get Mon test token. Okay, so for many of you who have been having issues on how you can get Mon token, this video is going to solve it for you. So you can use this this method as many times as possible. Okay, so this method is actually you know it's actually legit and it depends on how you want to go it go go about it now there's a method uh there's a method whereby you have to pay a little bit and there is another method whereby you are going to do everything just for free okay so the first thing i want you to get is that you are going to need what we refer to as sepolia is now for those of you who have been conversant with uh with airdrop you know that sepolia it is something that we normally use in farming airdrop projects a lot like sepolia it so so there are two ways you can get sepolia it you can either buy or you use a free faucet whereby you can get sepolia it for free so one of the ways that uh, that i normally use in getting sepolia it is to use the google cloud faucet okay so this is the google cloud faucet all you just need to do is to come over to this website and and then you select sepolia this is this is ethereum sepolia so you click on this so once you click on this then you paste your wallet address right here that's your ethereum uh, wallet address then you are going to get 0 0.05 sepolia now once you have this 0 0.05 sepolia you can go and use it to get mon token which i'm going to show you how to do that but then again this 0 0.05 might not actually do much for you so oftentimes some people normally come over to this particular website to buy sepolia it yes you can buy sepolia it all you just need to do is to come over to this website connect your wallet and then you can select you can select ethereum on any ethereum network so let's say let, this is ethereum on ethereum network you can use ethereum on, on optimism you can use the one of arbitrum to buy to buy ethereum sepolia so you can either use any of these three network arbitrum optimism and ethereum mainnet so any one of them that you that you want to use so you could buy it uh, ethereum sepolia what let's say 0 0.001 0 0.001 should be able to give you we give you seven 99 sepolia it okay so meaning that you can and this particular fee right now this should be around probably around three dollar should be around three dollar to two two dollar seventy cent or so this is 0 0.01 so 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 all i'm trying to say is that you can use real money to buy sepolia it but for me i i don't use that but many people normally use this if they don't have that commitment to go and be using something like this every single day and there are other faucet out there i'm going to put the link to the video i made concerning on how to get uh, on how to get faucet how to get especially sepolia it i made a dedicated video back then so i'm going to put the link in the description below so you can check it out there are so many ways you can get sepolia it some of them will require that you have some ethereum on your ethereum mainnet you uh, before you can claim sepolia it so so that's just it. one of my favorite avenue is is uh alchemy alchemy.com if you go to alchemy.com you'll be able to get sepolia it and not just only sepolia it you can get other tokens as well this is base sepolia this is optimism sepolia this arbitrum sepolia and so many other you know other testnet tokens like that so one of the things i normally do is that i make sure i collect ethereum sepolia base sepolia i collect optimism sepolia and arbitrum sepolia so what so what i normally do is i come over to relay.link now now uh relay we normally use relay but there is also a testnet bridge that comes with relay so if you come over to more right here you click on this and it's going to show you test net okay you so you click on test net and it's going to take you to relay you know it's going to take you to relay testnet bridge it's going to take you to relay testnet bridge and there you'll be able to bridge I say from Abitrum Sepolia, this Abitrum Sepolia, Abitrum Sepolia, Base Sepolia, and so on. You will be able to bridge your Ethereum from there down to Sepolia, uh, Sepolia Ethereum. Okay, so meaning that you'll be able to have more, uh, more Ethereum on your Sepolia, on your Sepolia. That is the trick there actually. So I'm going to put the link in the description below. So, th so this is it right now. You can see this is Base, Base Sepolia. If I open it, you're going to see abstract arbitrum blueberry okay i don't normally use this but this arbitrum sepolia this is this is base sepolia now if you did let's say let's assume that you did afra testnet back then whereby we bridge ethereum from ethereum sepolia down to habit to down to afra you can swap that afra ethereum back to it uh, the, the back to sepolia ethereum right here let me look for sepolia ethereum this sepolia you can see sepolia here this is 
or optimism Sepolia. so you can select any of these guys and bridge them from here down here so if you are using let's say one let's say one ethereum uh, one yeah, ethereum so you're going to get 0 0.69 so so there's always going to be a loss right here but then again since it is free token you are not buying it so like you can easily you know you can easily go ahead with this transaction but if it is but if you are using this method you are going to get your ethereum sepolia, uh, sepolia straight up so once you've gotten your ethereum sepolia the next thing you want to do you want to come over to orbital finance so this is a testnet of orbital finance and you'll be able to bridge your sepolia down to monad sepolia you can see so you'll be able to bridge your ethereum from ethereum sepolia down to monad sepolia and it's going to be in ethereum it's going to be in ethereum okay so let's say uh, right now i don't have any I don't, I don't have any sepolia right here so just make sure you enter the amount and also on orbital finance as well there are other other uh testnets that are available like let's say linear sepolia let's say you have linear sepolia you have scroll sepolia you'll be able to bridge it this is arbitrum sepolia this is this uh that is blast this is blast this is base sepolia so as many of these things right here you'll be able to you know you'll be able to bridge them down to down to this uh, down to this but mind you if you are using if you are using any of those any of those uh net uh network other than sepolia it you need to first of all bridge to sepolia it first then you now bridge to monad sepolia because oftentimes many of them might they might not bridge directly to Mona Sepolia. So you have to bridge to Sepolia it first and then move it to Mona Sepolia. So once you've completed this bridging right here, the next thing you want to do is to go and swap this Ethereum. Remember that you, you bridge Ethereum from Sepolia it down to Mona Sepolia. So it's already on Monad network right now, Mona testnet, but is in form of Ethereum. Okay, so you still need to go and, and get mon token so which you can actually get on ambient.finance okay so you can get it on ambient.finance so all you just need to do is to come over here and then bridge you click on you click on this you click on ethereum you select this is ethereum right here you select ethereum and then you select mon token right here and then you'll be able to you know you'll be able to make make the purchase so right now i'm having zero point let me reduce this so i'm having zero point zero five here and if i'm going to submit this i'm going to get 0 0.21 month token if you check the balance of my month token right now i'm having 44 month token and in fact i've already used some uh, so, uh some of my month token on different on different uh you know on different protocols on on mon testnet so i've already used it the one i've staked the one i've swapped for many other different tokens out there on on mona testnet so that's why i'm still having this 44 right now so if you have this kind of number you'll be able to interact with virtually every single one of those uh, decentralized application on mona testnet so that is just it so this is just the surest way for you to get mona uh you know mona testnet I'll, alongside those free options i've already made a video about this is actually the number one you know my favorite route right now in order for you to in order for you to get it so you can either buy sepolia uh buy uh, you can either buy sepolia right here or you buy or i mean or you get it free on this kind of website right here okay so this is just this code right here now for the sake of those of you who watch to the end so i decided to make this one this bonus for the sake of those who watch this video to the end so there's this particular discord server the name of this is block vision so all you just need to do is to join their you, you join their testnet i mean you join their discord server so once you join the discord server you go and look for where it says monad faucet so you just paste this code right here like for this person right here this exclamation mask uh, exclamation mask faucet and then you paste your but then there's a space there then you paste your wallet address right here and then you click enter so you're going to get something like 0 0.14 you're going to get something like 0 0.14 for um uh, month token in your in your wallet and you can do this every 24 hours so you have a 24 hours interval for you to uh, i mean for you to send another message and you're going to receive and you're going to receive month token as well so this is actually what i've been using for the past few days in order for me to get more additional month token for you so that i can be able to interact with with many of those uh, uh uh projects that are built on monad so if you find any value in this video make sure you like and subscribe if you are yet to subscribe because this is where i uh this is where the alpha is being shared so make sure you subscribe to this channel
i see you guys in my next video please ensure you share this video to as many people as possible out there who are farming monad airdrop make sure you share this video with them so share it with your community members your friends family that are watch i mean that are trying to farm monad airdrop i see you guys in my next video bye for now